Okay, this is going to be an exercise to help you organize the way that you use your feet and the way that your body relates to the ground. So first of all, you're standing with your feet four to six inches apart and with the second toe pointed straight forward. And now put the tennis ball under your left foot. Once again, make sure that your toes are pointed forward and the ball will be under the ball of the foot, under the knuckles of the toes. And get your feet lined up so they're just right. And now you're going to do a slight squat. Your arms are going to be at the side. You're going to keep the lower back back or the waist back and sink toward the ground. Your weight's going through the place that's right in front of the heel. And now press into that place right in front of the heel to stand back up. Once again, sing toward that place right in front of the heel. Try to get the sense of your knees moving straight forward rather than together. And press into the floor to stand up. And a third time, sink toward that spot right in front of the heel. And press into it to stand back up. Good. And now move the ball aside so that you can feel the difference in the way your two feet relate to the ground. Okay, now bring the ball back. And this time it's going to go under the back of the heel so that if you look behind yourself, you'll see a slight yellow crescent behind you. And once again with your feet four to six inches apart. and your toes pointed straight forward. Keep your lower back, or we call it the waist, back and squat toward that place right in front of the heel. And then press into that place right in front of the heel to stand up. Bring your hands to your sides. Sink toward that spot right in front of the heel and press into it to stand back up. And this is the third time keeping your waist back and your shoulders and arms at your sides and press into that spot in front of the heel to stand up. Once again, move the ball aside so that you can feel the difference in your two feet. Okay, and now bring the ball back and put it right in front of the heel. This is the center of gravity for the foot. Now this time as you do the squat, you're going to keep the foot level so that the heel doesn't go down, nor does the ball of the foot go down. It stays kind of level. And now sink toward that spot right in front of the heel, keeping the waist back and press into it to stand up. Sink toward that spot in the foot Press into it to stand back up. Being aware of the knees going straight forward as you squat. And into your foot to stand back up. And move the ball aside. Okay, good. Now while you're there, I want you to raise your toes off the ground. And now sway forward till you're heavy on the balls of your feet and back till you're heavy on the heels. And forward till you just begin to be heavy on the ball of the feet. And back till you just begin to be heavy on the heels. And now forward till you just begin to go onto the ball of the foot and back till you just begin to be on the heel. Till you're balanced between the ball of the foot and the heel. And then let your toes float long down to the ground. And this should be a nice balanced standing for you.